Mitchell, thanks very much. Um, nice. Another year in Paris. Does it feel any different this year to last year? Uh, I mean, besides the weather, <laughs> it's been pretty cold actually this year. But uh, I mean, well, you missed all the hot weather. Let me yeah, tell you. Yeah, <laughs> exactly. I guess that's true. But um, I feel a little bit better this year. I'm more confident heading into the tournament, and I've played two rounds already, and I'm feeling really good. So I'm excited to see how it goes. Anything that you've picked up this year that um, yeah, maybe was not quite there last year? I mean, uh, whether it's something different in the locker room, whether it's a different speed on the courts, whether there's something different on your game over here? Um, well, I mean, I, I got the same locker I had last Did year, you? so I, mean, I guess I'll start there. But I feel I'm higher ranked this year going into it, and I, I, I had a good tournament in Milan got to the quarters and had match points on the guy that won the tournament. So I'm um, heading into the tournament with quite a bit of confidence. I feel like I'm playing really well. And I mean, as opposed to last year, I, I, it was my first time playing main draw here. So uh, I mean, obviously I was, I thought I could win last year, but this year I have, uh, it's just to feel a little bit different. I feel like I have a better chance. A little bit more confidence, the, yeah. the fact that you've got a bit more experience under your belt? That's Yeah, that's very true. More experience. I've played all the slams already, so I think I have a lot of experience over some of these younger guys coming okay. up. What about the courts? Uh, uh, are you totally comfortable on the clay courts, the red clay courts? Uh, I'm feeling really comfortable right now. I know in the past some people would say Americans don't feel very comfortable, but last year I think we had a good showing. and. I'm definitely feeling really comfortable and I'm playing really well, so. Mm -hmm. Now, coming into Paris, is this a, a city that you enjoy being in? And I, I love Paris. Do yeah. you? Uh, it's, all the slams are in some of the best cities, you know, like a big city. I really enjoy Paris and I, I like the atmosphere of this tournament and it always has a good showing, a lot of people. I got a good court today, so. Right. What about the crowds here? I mean, do you find them to be quite different to some of the other slams and and, uh, and if so how I think they're a little bit low-key as opposed to some other slams really like maybe maybe not Wimbledon but definitely to like US and Australia definitely New York has some pretty rowdy fans but uh, I, I played a French kid today and there, I mean there was a fair amount of of cheering for him, but I think for the most part they've been pretty respectful of the other opponent. Does uh, does that bother you in a match, or are you able to shut it out quite uh, easily? I'm pretty well, pretty good at shutting it out, and uh, I actually I like when there's big crowds. I don't care if they're for me or against me, really. <laughs> but I mean, I enjoy playing under a lot of pressure and playing with a lot of people uh, watching. As to the atmosphere, which uh, I mean, it helps. I would think helps lift your yeah. morale and feeling and all that on the I, court. I think I play better on yeah. big courts, so. Uh, just about Paris itself, I was talking to Taylor Townsend the other day, and uh, I asked her if she's had a chance to uh, try try escargot. Oh, <laughs> I actually, actually last year I, I did, did try it, and um, it's actually not that bad. Really? I, I had it with a, a lot of butter. Yeah, so. garlic butter? Yeah, so I mean, I, I guess I wasn't really tasting it 100%, but I actually enjoyed it. So. What else have you tried over here That's, that could be quite different and not part of the regular diet for you? Um, well, I mean, the first thing that comes to mind is Nutella, but I, mean, I wouldn't I wouldn't really call that something like exotic, like something like escargot is. But I mean, I I, I enjoy the food here. I think it's one of the better tournaments with food. And yeah, it's not, it's not bad. The yeah, French food. Yeah, it's pretty good. Yeah. Okay. Now, what have you got planned coming up? Um, after this, I think we're going back home for ten days, and then Roehampton, Wimbledon. We'll be back to London. So. And then, as far as the rest of the summer, I'm not sure before Kalamazoo, like the big national mm -hmm. tournament in the U.S. So, those are the three big ones coming up after this. So, yeah, okay. that's it. Mitchell, thanks very much. We look forward to talking to you again. Thank you.